Well, there was a fatal accident this morning involving an NFTA paratransit bus. It happened on the ramp from the Route 190 South to the 290 East. Channel 2's Dave McKinley has been following the story since this morning, and he's live at the NFTA headquarters downtown to update us. Dave? Mary Alice, the NFTA police have set about what they call will be a very thorough investigation of this accident, but they do so with heavy hearts because the person killed in the mishap was a nine-year NFTA employee. Now, that ramp you mentioned was closed for four hours this morning for what the NFTA police chief told me will be a very thorough probe. They want to find out how this vehicle ended up on its side around 6 o'clock this morning. We are told that 60-year-old Shakita Smith, who trained other drivers, was declared dead at the scene. According to police, she was not the driver of the vehicle. The driver and one passenger on board suffered what are described as non-life-threatening injuries. There are, there are many, many details that need to be explained. And again, we're just, we're, you know, hours into this and there's just so much um, to uncover. So we need to let our investigators kind of do their job and, and not speculate as to what took place. The investigation will look into a host of possibilities, including but not limited to whether the paratransit bus was cut off, whether the driver being trained made an error or suffered a medical emergency themselves, or if there was even a mechanical problem with that vehicle. Now, Chiquita Smith is described by an NFTA spokesperson as having been a popular and beloved employee with a very large family of her own, including numerous brothers and sisters, all of whom have been told of her tragic passing. Live in downtown Buffalo, Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.